Hi, hello everyone. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Nur Shafiq bin Shahruddin. I am 24 years old this year. Um, I was actually the graduate of LG240, um, English for Professional Communications. Um, I am the current holder of the Best Student Award um, of Academy Pengajian Bahasa, as well as the current recipient of uh, Anugerah Pingat Remas Yayasan Buriman from UITM, Sha'ala. Career-wise, right now I'm working as an HR Operations Analyst at Slumberger, one of the biggest MNC companies in Malaysia. Um, I cover the basis for the uh, MENA region, which is the Middle Eastern and North um, African region, um, which are Pakistan, Iraq, and also Oman. So my day-to-day -day, um, tasks um, include um, answering queries from employees, um, approving workflows, uh, as well as uh, handling some documentation and personal info for the employees of the same uh, region. When I was still a student, I can be considered as one of the most active ones. I participated in a lot of competitions, I joined a lot of clubs and organizational bodies, and I also joined a lot of events, um, both international and local events. Um, it was very, very memorable, it was a sweet experience. And uh, one of the most notable ones would be when I was given the honor to be um, one of the MC for this international event hosted by our very own faculty, Academy Pengajian Bahasa. And I must say that it was truly an honor to be able to minister the whole event and to welcome the international delegates. So yeah, it, it is something that I would never um, forget uh, my whole life. and. It was truly memorable. All right, um, on to the next one, studying tips. Um, I'm not the kind of person who would bury my face in books because I just don't like the idea of it. And I'm also not the kind of person who would go back home and revise whatever that I've learned that day. So I would make sure that I give my 200% commitment and focus in class um, just to make sure that I don't miss out on anything important and I would also prepare some notes and I would highlight um, stuff that I think should be remembered so that I could excel in exam or tests or um, in doing my assignment. And I actually found a way to study but to also have fun. So I would sometimes watch a movie and that's how I harness my language skill and my communication skill and I don't know if you realize, some movies are full of grammatical errors. So I would just pinpoint the errors that I found throughout the movie and I would just you know, break it down and just fix the grammars right there and then. And from there, I would just break it down to syntax and to, um, um, to a lot of other components that I learned in class, just so that I could understand um, the topic and head better. So yeah, those are some of the ways um, that I did um, in, in university and while I'm studying. Alright, last but not least, um, I'm not sure if I'm the best person to give an advice of any sort, but yeah, I will leave this as a parting note. Um, if you want to be successful, not as a student, uh, but also as a person, um, as a whole, I think you should remember that Knowledge is vast and knowledge is meant to be shared. So I practice this a lot of times and I've been doing this since high school up till um, you know, university. Um, I would always um, find ways to share whatever that I know with my friends. And if I found out that my friends are a little missing out on things that I think I am better at, I would make sure that these people would be able to grasp even the basic of it. So yeah, I would share everything that I know and I would make sure that these people are you know, up to par to the level of knowledge that I think um, is expected of them. And next, I think this is the most important one, to always, always um, be careful with how you treat everyone around you, especially your lecturers, and yeah, you should be more 
respect, respectful towards your lecturers and uh, follow the deadlines, meet the deadlines and to be kind and nice to everyone and um, also remember that your education is number one your education should be your number one priority but to also make sure that you don't miss out on things that's happening in campus because I gotta say that if you are the kind of person that would just focus on studies and that's it all the way through the end you'll miss out on a lot of things um, life and campus could and should be enjoyable so enjoy the white last and with that thank you